guys it's been a while I did not film at all last week I it was my birthday week and uh, come Monday a bout of depression hit me and I'm still struggling with it um, I am trying to pull myself out of this hole it was a good week at work it was busy which helps me so much when I'm busy but um, just sitting here by myself is tough. Um, anyway, I've got a lot of videos for you this week. Uh, I got some money for, excuse me, I have an itch. I got some money for my birthday, so I did go on a little bit of a spending spree to two places. So I will show you one of those. I don't have the other one yet. That'll be next week. Um, I just did my makeup. I'm having a extremely bad hair day. This is the third day since I've washed my hair. I've been trying to let it go a little bit longer. Um, they say that that's healthier for you if you just let it go a little bit. Um, three days is as long as I can go. I'll wash it tomorrow morning without it driving me crazy. You know, it starts itching me and all that gross stuff. So, uh, and I also am having a horrible lipstick day. <laughs> I am just not good with the doe foot applicators with the liquid lip, liquid um, matte lipstick. I am just not good at that. And so, therefore, I've got like a red ring around my mouth. <laughs> but I decided the heck with it, I was going with it. So let's show you what I wore in makeup today. I had to throw one of my foundations out, one of my older foundations. It's probably over, oh, about a year old, Wet n' Wild foundation because it, I don't know what you call that when you put it on your hand and all you're getting is lumps. Is that oxidizing? Is that what that's called? So anyway, I tossed it. I put it in my uh, empties case to do at a later date. And I'm very sorry, but I have an itch. It's not that my nose is running or anything today. I just have an itch. All right. So anyway, so then I went with my, I decided to go with my, uh, something I don't wear a whole lot. But I don't know why, because it went on very smoothly. It it matches my skin tone very well. It um, I used a brush and buffed it in, and it went on wonderfully. It went on actually better than my with a brush than my Rimmel um, Stay 24 Hour Foundation that my new one. That one there smears on me if I use a brush. So, anyway, this is what I used. It is in the color 100 Light Pale. And I really like it. It's an anti-aging. Uh, it's a smart shade. So it says it's skin tone matching makeup. Um, SPF 20, broad spectrum, light pale, one fluid ounce. So that's what I used there. I did not use any primer. I'm going to take my makeup off right away. So I didn't put on a primer. I didn't do anything extra today. So I don't feel like this is sitting right. <laughs> okay, so then I used um, for my brows. I did my brows next. I used my NYX mascara, uh, tinted brow mascara in brunette. And that is what that looks like. If it'll... There we go. And that's got a like this. Um, I wish the the comb or the spoolie would be just a little bit shorter on this one, like it is on my Alta one. That's my favorite, my Alta, because the the spoolie fits so well to my eyebrows. Okay, so then I went with eyeshadow, and I decided I was going to use this. I rarely use this. I don't. I don't want to blind you here, but it's my Smashbox uh, Wonder Vision Mega Palette, and I got this oh probably a year ago in a giveaway, 
and it's beautiful. It's just beautiful. Look at all those colors. It's got a large mirror. What I used is I used this as a base today for all over my lids, and I was just so attracted to this color. So I used that on my, you know, like I said, I didn't do anything special today. I just used this on my, my, um, <laughs> eyelid. <laughs> okay, and then I used this as a blush, the second one. So beautiful. Got just a tiny bit of sparkle in there. I'm trying to get this so you can see it a little bit better, the colors. Okay. And mascara. I used Volume Accelerator uh, Mascara with AVEC Volume Boosting Complex. And this is by, must be Rimmel. It's got the crown on it, so it must be Rimmel. Rimmel. Okay, this is what it looks like. And I got to say, you know, I liked this a lot when I first got it. But today, it was very clumpy. Very clumpy. See, it's got kind of a weird spoolie. But it really clumped my lashes together, and I was not taking it off and putting it back on. So you got what you got. Um, oh, by the way, I used this sparkly brown, just a touch of it, um, on my bottom eyelid there to, you know, for kind of like a more effective deal. And then I used the Kat Von D. Uh, I cannot see what color this is. I should have found my magnifying glass, but I did not. Okay. So anyway, that's what it looks like. It's just a mini one um, on my waterline, my bottom waterline. I'm dropping stuff here. Okay, for concealer, I used my Better Skin. I mean, right now, this is my favorite one that I have. I do want to get a, is it a Fit Me um, concealer? Because I've heard a lot of people say that they really like that one. Tell me below, what is your favorite concealer? And tell me why, would you? Because um, I'm just, I'm on the hunt for a concealer that works. This one here is okay, but it really still doesn't work that well for my my skin my old skin all right so then i used for blush oh i showed you my blush already in the smashbox palette and then i used the natural nude um highlighting palette by physicians formula i just love this palette i just think it's so beautiful it's coming apart though that's coming apart. It's just in a little box with a cute little bow on it. Okay, to finish off, I used my Stay Matte, my Rimmel Stay Matte, which is my favorite face powder. That is in Buff Beige. Um, it could even be just a tiny bit lighter for my skin tone. Um, okay, for lipstick. I used the Revlon Colorstay Ultimate Liquid Lipstick in Top Tomato, which is like this, like this, and it is, I don't know, do you guys have a trick for putting on liquid lipstick, or lipstick with doe foot? Um, I'm fine with lighter stuff. But the darker stuff, I have such a hard time. The stuff that you can really see the lines, I have a really hard time putting that on. Um, any trips and trips, tips and or tricks? Let me know. And I will talk to you very soon. I have several videos to do today since I didn't do last week's. So I will see you in a few. Bye bye.